Today, we learn about how to go about planning our careers amidst this lockdown. To begin with, I think, you know, before we take any steps, the most important thing to do is to fix our mindset. Mindset is everything. You can set big goals and make great plans, but challenges and changes will always pop up. So it's important to adopt what's called a growth mindset. Our kids must learn to see change as a constant, challenges as opportunities and careers as journeys. And above all, learn to take care of themselves. The journey is long and you don't want to burn out. Then the other thing that you have to keep in mind is to be prepared for the long haul. What does that mean? That means, you know, many young people who I meet, they want and they're looking for immediate rewards. You want to be a YouTube or Instagram influencer and become an overnight success. But the reality is that most successful people got there by playing the long game. They understand that it takes hard work to get to the top. The rule popularized by Malcolm Gladwell in his very popular book called The Outliers uh, says that if you practice one skill for 10,000 hours, you will have a good chance, good chance of becoming an expert at it. Even Amazon's Jeff Bezos will attest to the fact that any overnight success takes about 10 years. You know, so nothing happens, nothing, nothing happens overnight. Another very unusual thing, piece of little piece of advice that I'd like to offer you is to listen to your intuition. The intuitive mind is a very precious gift and the rational mind is a faithful servant. And this is not what I'm saying. This is something that Einstein said. And we, but on the other hand, we've created a society that honors the servant, but has forgotten the gift. I've studied many entrepreneurs who built multi crore businesses from the ground up. Without exception, one key factor that's contributed to their success is listening to that inner voice. Once you relax your mind and access your deeper consciousness, the answers are already there waiting for you. So do speak to others. Do, you, do speak to counselors like me, to your parents, to your elders, to your friends, to, to your peers. But listen to yourself first. That is so important. And the next point. Take small action steps instead of giant leaps. Dream big, certainly, but start small. Let's say your goal is to write a book, but you haven't done any actual writing, any so far, you haven't written a blog. It's not going to be easy to go from zero to becoming a Chetan Bhagat in one leap. You know? So to achieve career success, map out the small action steps that will get you closer to your goal. And that is another thing that you have to do. If little, little baby steps add up to big things. And this is the time to start taking those baby steps. Start writing, start creating your own blog. Even when you are, uh, you know, on social media, instead of just forwarding things, you know, spend down your opinion and, you know, contribute that to your friends. It'll just remove that little block that you have. This is only as far as writing is concerned, but this applies to just about everything else. And the first action step that you can take to map out your career and your career goals is to start exploring. You know, this is a process that we leave right to the end or sometimes we even ignore it. I would say start exploring the options that you have shortlisted. There's a wealth of information online, wealth. There's YouTube, there's Quora, there's so much of, there's Wikipedia. So do your little browsing and exploring there. After that, speak to people who are already in those fields. 
you know, and don't speak to just one person because one person who's right on the top may paint a very rosy picture and somebody who's right at the bottom or somebody who's frustrated with his career will paint a very negative picture. So speak to three or four people in that field. See if you can intern, even albeit online, and that will give you a real feel of whether that field is really meant for you or you should be looking at something else. Of course, there are several other steps that you can take and we will uh, keep exploring those in the subsequent videos. But till then, let's keep learning.